All right, viewers and subscribers, blessed Sunday. My name is Dancer Skill. I'm there again. You see? All right, so I have a piece of an entire video that I'll be posted on social media that I'm going to present to you, my viewers and subscribers. Yeah, the entire video that I'll be posted on social media shows a person who some people on social media call daily, and in the video she talked about. Uh, a person who goes by the name of Prophet Dr. Watson on social media and she talk about other things as well. But before I present that piece of video to you, my viewers and subscribers, I want to talk to you about uh, some things that uh, came to my attention. You understand? Now, I saw pictures in a post somewhere on social media that uh, shows the person who goes by the name of Prophet Dr. Watson on social media. And according to some comments that have been made about uh, those pictures in the post that I saw on social media, I got the understanding that some persons are wondering if Prophet Dr. Watson is actually blind in one of his eyes. I also got the understanding that some persons are wondering if he's lying about being blind in one of his eyes, viewers and subscribers. You see me? Now, I want to point out certain things. You see me, viewers and subscribers? You see, if someone really and truly is blind, this is not something to mock or disrespect anyone about, you see me? Yeah, we want to point out that very clearly, you understand? Now, camera angles can make someone's left look like his right and someone's right look like his left, you understand? So yeah, so let me point out those things, you see me? And let me give you some what of a proof. Now, in at least one of those pictures that I saw on social media, it would seem as if his right eye is damaged. However, when I look at that picture carefully, viewers and subscribers, it seems as if he's wearing a ring on one of his fingers on the same side of his body where that eye is damaged. See? However, when I take a good look at another picture in the same post that I saw on social media, it would seem as if his left eye is damaged. See? And I look carefully at that picture and I see something on one of his fingers that seems to be a ring and it would seem as if he's wearing that ring on the same side of his body where that left eye is damaged according to the picture that i saw see now i look at the picture carefully and i saw that he's wearing a watch in that picture of yours and subscribers now my people from me a little youth and to me a big man i come to the realization that a lot of people like to wear watch on their left hand some people have to wear watch on their right and even both hands as well to you know my people but that's the understanding that i got does it so maybe maybe camera angles make it seems as if his left eye is damaged at one point in a picture and then it seems as if his right eye is damaged in another picture you see me i say so people don't be quick to jump to conclusion and don't believe everything you see posted on social media because you see some people some people will manipulate certain situations on social media and make things look certain way for their own benefit you see me i say my people now I want you to please bear in mind that I am not confirming that this man is actually blind in one of his eyes. No, I do not know this man's medical condition. I'm only pointing out certain things that have been said on social media and giving you my opinions and point of views. All right, so you can let me know what you think about the things that I said when it comes down to the situation that I talked about or about the things that I just said, isn't it? And I'm going to move on to another topic. All right, now here's an update about the 14-year-old girl who goes by the last name of Thomas, who is from the parish that is known as St. Thomas, that's within the country of Jamaica, who was reported missing from the 2nd of November the year 2021. Now, I got uh, information that she had been returned home. Yes, according to the Jamaica Constabulary Force, it is said that she had returned home. Yes, it is said that she had been found and it is said that she's okay and that she's in good health. You see me I say? Yeah, um, it is said that she had returned home more than a day ago, viewers and subscribers. That's from today. More than a day ago. I'm not sure exactly when. You see me I say? And I didn't get any confirmed information as to where she had been found either. All right? But good news is that uh, she had been found and she had returned home or she had returned home. You see me? that's the good news so i'm just making you know about that my people all right next topic now my people i want you to take a good look at this picture right here yes take a good look at this picture right here 
Now, this picture, among other pictures, have been posted somewhere on social media claiming to show a new way how to baptize someone or to baptize people. You see? Yeah, the understanding that I got from those pictures that I saw on social media is that uh, someone will stand in the middle of a circle draw on the ground and there's a pipe system that run over above the circle and then someone will turn on the water in the pipe system and water fall and whosoever is standing in the middle of the circle that's drawn on the ground and so forth and that's considered to be the new way to baptize someone or to baptize people now my people i cannot confirm if this is actually a new way to baptize someone or to baptize people no but that's the understanding that i got i'm just telling you my understanding now maybe this whole thing had been done somewhere else out there in the world i don't know yes i'm asking my people but would i like to know what you think about this alleged new way to baptize someone or to baptize people tell me what you think yeah my people yes i'm say. All right, now, I am going to present to you the piece of the entire video that I've been posted on social media that shows a female who some people on social media call daily. Some person might also call her prophecy daily as well. Now, remember, in the entire video that I've been posted on social media, the female talk about uh, the person who goes by the name of... Uh, prophet dr watson and she also talk about other things as well in the video that i saw posted on social media so viewers and subscribers let me know what i think about uh, the things that the female said in this piece of video that i'm about to present to you all right here's the video take a good look listen and observe the reason why i'm doing this live the young man that will be taking over Pastor Simit Church. Really? And will tell me on the views and the situation. Listen, people. Okay. Don't use your head and judge people. We have to get for know people. True. So I had a conversation with him last night. The mm -hmm. young man that will be taking over um, Pastor Simit Church. The pastor that died. Yeah, will be. That they say he's a cult pastor. Will be. So me and Mr. Watson, Prophetess Watson, mm -hmm. we have a talk last night on Facebook. Mm -hmm. So my child show me say he will be taking over the mantle and taking over the church once the church is cleansed. What's your take on that situation? Cleanse. You think that Prophetess Watson is really of God? Do you think that this guy is just a joke and he's just going to become just like Kevin? You see, we can't judge people. And that's one thing because I slept on it last night and I say, God, maybe I didn't give him the chance to prove himself. Mm -hmm. And he seems like a very sincere young man. But however, whatever took place is very deep. Really? And that's what I'm trying to bring across to him. Your associate, you're basically <laughs> about to carry on something where people have lost their life. Oh, okay, people the have totally lost their life. Maybe then, and he's too. brave to really want to do that. That's right. So, I was saying to him, you know, how can the people believe you? Mm -hmm. So I want him to come to my life this morning. Can I tell him, say I'm going to pull up my life. I'm, I'm I want him to come talk to the people them. No, come talk to the people them. And the reason why I'm why you to come talk to the people them, I tag him in the live because I want him to come and talk to the people them. Tell the people them how you're going to go forward with, um, with, with a church where three people have lost their life. The bishop of the church have done something that history can never erase out of Jamaica. How mm -hmm. are you planning to go forward with a church Michael like Mark that? That's one of the biggest things in our history. You know, Jamaica. I would love one to of... know and I should have given him I should have given him the chance to explain that. You know, sometimes you have to accept a person until you can prove them wrong and mm -hmm. there was something that he said to me that really hit home and right. really um really touching 
He don't plan to go on with the mess. He plan to cleanse the church and go on with the church. You know, you know talk to me. You know think about that. I want to think about that. May the past fasting this morning. I may have church. some school work. May have to finish. And may have only part thing. Uno think mm -hmm. say. Uno think say Pastor Wat and um, Prophetess Watson that is associated with um. He did not said he was associated with um Pastor um Kevin Simmet. Mm -hmm. Let me be um clear about that. He said once the church is cleansed he will be associated with the ministry that's oh. what he said um last night okay. so let me clarify that coming I mean, I mean, I want the wrong message get off of my life he said once the church is cleansed and he's right why them I judge the people them that was a part of the ministry why and i said it every day why judge the people and why say those horrible things about them so who is this guy mm -hmm. you know me i ask myself so serious people me ask church, myself that's why i want him to come by me like this, this morning i told him i would do a live and if he see this live more if you come talk to the people then well my people in my point of view, it seems as if she's letting persons on social media know that he said that he's going to take over where Kevin Smith's church was at. You see what I say? And I think she make one good point, my people. Yeah, viewers and subscribers, I think she make one solid good point, the least. You see? Mm -hmm. Persons lost their lives at that place where they want to call it templar building you see me i say so with all of that that happened how is a prophet dr watson going to gain people trust to believe in his ministry or church that he's going to keep at that place or have at that place you see me i say no think about it my people really think about it you see Anyways, big up skill and nation. You see me? Yeah, somebody give me that idea there in the comment section of one of my videos. You see me? I must big up that person to interview the subscribers. You see? Yes, yeah, skill and nation. I like the ring to it. Anyways, let me know what you think about the video that I presented to you and the things that I talked to you about in this video. Here's where I'm going to leave it. So until the next time, if you're new to my channel, do not be afraid to click the subscribe button. My name is Dancer Skilla. Uno big up on yourself. You see? Hey man, you can know where I watch. Dance on Skiller! Hear yeah, me Hey yo, Skiller! You are watching Dance on Skiller Entertainment.